frequency energy vibration reading for the hurt signs okay I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful um wonderful year that we have spent together and welcome all newcomers if this is your first time this is the moon energy vibration reading for all the hurt signs who are the hurt signs they are the Taurus um, Virgos and Capricorn the earth signs or the Taurus Virgos and Capricorns okay I want to say um, thank you for the extreme support that you guys have um, I've given to my channel and please continue to support um, the channel because I um, am going to be bringing forward more um, new stuff um, that is going to be helping you guys to align I'm sorry I have done the air sign people I was looking for my deck okay so um, thank you so much um, for the wonderful support in this year thank you for um, being here um, every month and um, helping us um, seeing um, what is happening um, thanks to each and every person for the donations um, and uh, um, for really really um, doing um, the on demand because um, there are a lot of people I'm um, receiving message that a lot of people are really really loving the on demand because the on demand is giving them so much more information that they can use so continue on demand the price will never change it's still 99 there's so much message it takes time to do all these uh, um, videos especially the readings for on demand for personalized reading remember um, to visit my website it's good to have a year reading or a birthday reading to really know where you are um, in this time remember we're working with different people um, for the energies of clearing energies around you that is uh, um, the Oracle um, Oracle touch and for your past life and different alignment of energies and situation you're dealing with um, 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 uh, the sacred soul okay so let's go and see what's happening for the hurt sign people the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn okay An energy fell out already and it's all about Venus love oh my gosh I spoke and <laughs> it's as if that is the central they're saying for your reading uh, my guides are really popping um, <laughs> this moon reading my guys are really popping yes Venus love it's all about love in this full moon for you earth sign people so let's move on and see what's happening for you earth sign people okay so for the sun sign people these are the people who were born in the day we are um, we are having um, the Aries and uh, um, Mercury is coming back um, Mercury is really in this and the Capricorns Sun sign Capricorns you're going to be a lightning up the Sun sign Capricorns are really really going to be lightning up in this Capricorn this Capricorns and I guess it's because it's the Capricorns birthday that they are lightning up let's see what's happening for the moon people um, we have this energy um, out of um, Mars career career for the moon people whatever is happening it's going to affect the career sectors with the Aries and Venus so there is some love some of you are going to be finding love on the work for um, you or um, in career in general and in your career and love Wow okay so let's see what else is popping um, you have Pluto okay oh you moon people you got Pluto oh 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 you moon people have Pluto that's kind of weird okay and, and they're saying no it's not weird it's what we give you <laughs> okay all right Saturn is here Saturn is going to be affecting there's Saturn here affecting a lot of you Saturn is here affecting a lot of you and you Uranus 
Oh my. Yep. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's pop in and see what is happening. Oh. Okay, Uranus is here. It's as if it's 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 really the change of guards um, for this full moon. Okay, but Venus is hitting you guys because this is good. Um, the Taurus says um, is bringing in the love, 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 love is coming out. So um, first, we're going to be looking at what is you know coming out at you, Uranus, Uranus. I, you know there is just certain planets that really Uranus is coming out. People, Uranus is going to be so popping. It's it's uncomfortable, okay. Um, it's, it's it's going to be the change of guards when Uranus is here. It's popping. It's 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 like it, it's it's coming up in a way that you never ever expected to um come up. Okay, Uranus is like removing things. Okay, so for the sun sign people, what is going to affect you and your motto for the spirit is going to be your unique self expressions, demands, and outlet now. Don't worry about what others say, just be yourself. So for, so for you, sun sign people, whatever is happening, um, it's, 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 a, it's a time of expression. Um, you know, don't worry about what other people say, but just be yourself. For the sun people for the moon people and remember the moon people is the people who are born after six o'clock in the evening and that's when the Sun goes down so for the moon people one person a lunatic is another person genius never doubt your own um, um, you know like never doubt yourself because someone might think that um, you're a lunatic or you might think that you're a lunatic but you're a genius for others, never doubt your own um, uh, uh, persist contribution to the world because sometimes we doubt ourselves, and that is what we um, need not to do. So we're going to be looking at the sun sign, which is on my left, and it's your right. Um, the sun sign. We, you are dealing with Aries, Mercury, and the Capricorn. Damn. Okay. So, um. Aries and Mercury oh my god that is another situation because when Aries and Mercury because remember Mercury is the planet of magic okay you are working magic in your life you're trying to transform your life with magic when Mercury comes in your life okay Mercury is the air sign and Mercury is such an an energy of uh, you aligning yourself with like positive positive situation and Mercury uh, Mercurius because we need to call them correctly it's all about asserting your point of view but don't bully okay so for you sun sign people you're you are going to be asserting your point of view but not bully okay because the Aries might be coming in and trying to bully you so you're going to be asserting your point of view but you're not going to be bully and it's going to be in the career sector because Mars is here okay it's going to affect you in your career session but Mars is here and what you earth signs are going to um, learn is that love is the key love is the key be super nice love is the key because that is what is going to be keeping you be super nice even when you think someone is a lunatic or an idiot be super nice okay because that is going to be the key now um, the effect that the Capricorn is bringing in Capricorns um, you're going to be teaching um, the Virgos and, and and the layers um, um, you're gonna be teaching them mistakes will um, is, is less farther than fair okay so it's as if learning from mistakes will lessen your fears okay so as and, and and this is what the Capricorns are going to be helping the Virgos and Taurus to do is to learn to teach them to learn from them their, their mistakes okay because it is the time when Saturn is in the Capricorn section section and the Capricorn themselves are learning but they are going to be teaching the Virgos and the Taurus to learn from the mistake and you know um, lessons it's not your fear 
okay it's it's really not going to be your favorite so this is going to be good as we look at um, the people who are born at night you have a career situation with a Scorpio and Pluto so Scorpio could be removed out of your life at, at your work okay so, so if some of you are dealing with a scorpion at your work this person is going to be removed out of your life because once Mars Mars or it, it could be a family member it could be at work for some of you but it could also be a family member and Mars in um, Mars with the scorpion is whatever you strongly desire can be yours okay so whatever you you um, earth sign people strongly desire in this full moon it will be yours you just need to manifest it okay whatever you strongly strongly desire it's going to be yours okay what is also happening whether it's in love or money whatever it is in it's going to be happening Pluto some of you um, is going to end a relationship um, with a scorpion you're going to decide um, I'm letting you go it is better for me to let you go you have ruined my life enough I'm letting you go so Pluto um, uh, Pluto is is, 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 is is as if when you are born in into the darkness watch for the light it's as if you moon people people who are born after 6 p.m. it's dawning into the darkness look for the light within a scorpion look for the light within a scorpion this person could be affecting you um, in a relationship this could be a child this could be someone but look for the darkness look for the light within this person because this person is carrying a very dark energy this person is being very very dark so look for the light within this person okay because whoever this person is they're working with negative energy um, whether this person is is working with negative energy and they're so focused um, with that negative energy is as if they can't live their life without me it could be someone has done this to this person and why this person is behaving like this and you're trying to find out what is the alignment of myself and this person in career some of you could be do, dealing with the scorpion um with the energy of pluto but saturn is here especially saturn is here and um the capricorns are going to be helping um the other sign to let go of certain things that no longer serve you because this is if you're holding on to something because you're thinking yeah i can't do with this person i can't do without this thing and the, the the energy of the Capricorns are coming in and said listen to listen to me uh, mr. Virgo or mrs. Virgo listen to me mr. Taurus and you know I have learned so much from my um, um, from the faults and the lessons that I've learned to let it go let it go whatever it is let it go okay oh so good so um be careful about a scorpion because the scorpion is working on the unconscious side the scorpion um you you, you have to be careful of a, a, a scorpion in your life okay and it's not a matter of being afraid of them or um don't want to be on a uh, scorpion is um it is working with Pluto so obviously you um, people who were born in the evening Pluto is the scorpion um, um, planet okay that means that the scorpions are ruled by Pluto Pluto is a water sign so the people who are in relationship with the scorpion be aware that they could be removing something or they themselves could be removing out of your life or you could be removing them out of your life okay it could be in relationships and we're going to be looking in relationship business situation and that sort of a situation because they are ruled by the planet of Pluto the scorpions are ruled by the planet of Pluto and it's going to affect especially especially um the the people who were born in the night after 6 p.m. 
okay you're a moon person because the moon govern you um, when you were born in the day you're a Sun person because the Sun governs you and this is the energy of the Sun and this is the energy of the moon as we look Uranus is here and with Uranus you're dealing with the Aquarians again the Aquarians are coming up they're the water bearers they're coming up they're the central of of, of this um, full moon so and then we have Venus so we have the Taurus and we have the Librans we have the Taurus and the Librans because Venus um, the Taurus and the Librans are, are ruled by the planet of Venus and this is love so as I look and I'm and 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 and, and